Frieda Hoffman, archaeologist and writer. Frieda Hoffman was born in Germany, but she has lived most of her life abroad. She has a passion for history and ancient civilizations. Her greatest love is Africa, and she has written several books about ancient Egypt. Frieda, you've traveled a lot in your lifetime. Which countries have you been to? Well, I've been to a lot of countries in Africa and Asia, but I've never been to South America. When did you first go abroad? When I was six, my family moved to England. Why did you move there? Because my father got a job as professor of history at Cambridge University. Have you always been interested in archaeology? Yes, I have. When I was ten, there was an exhibition of Tutankhamun, the Egyptian king, in London. My father took me to see it, and I was fascinated. After that, I knew that I wanted to go to Egypt and be an archaeologist. How many times have you been to Egypt? Twenty times at least. I go as often as I can. Have you ever discovered anything? Yes, I've made some very important discoveries. I was the leader of a team that discovered some ancient tombs near Cairo. You've written books about Egypt, haven't you? How many books have you written? I've written three about the pharaohs, and I've written a book about a journey I made from Cairo to Cape Town. How did you travel? By train? By car? In a Land Rover, of course. <laughs> In all your travels, have you ever been in any dangerous situations? Oh goodness, yes! I've often been in danger, but in situations like that, you learn so much about yourself.